man. If you want to change the news, you have to find the news. I'll go anywhere in search of a good story. Wherever the action is, I'm there. On the surface, our political process seems simple. Voters elect the representatives, and they represent the will of the voters, right? Wrong. At the center of this process lies the lobbyist. Hired by giant corporations to sway our politicians, these agents of corruption. Sorry, are the, uh... Who am I? I'd tell you, but I'm too busy reporting on something terrible. Something that's probably ruining the country, because that's what journalists do. And I'm a journalist. This is Disrupt, the disruptiest journalism your face has ever seen. We disrupt stuff like lobbying. I knew I had to disrupt that just as soon as someone would tell me what the hell it is. What do you do? Uh, I'm a public interest lobbyist. Whoa. I gotta disrupt you right there. First off, you're not a lobbyist. Lobbyists look like, I don't know, this guy. But if you insist... Give me a concrete example of how lobbying works. Okay, let's say that you run a business and there's a policy that you want passed in Washington. You hire a paid lobbyist here, maybe a former member of Congress. That person is gonna tell you how much money to give in campaign contributions to influence what's going on up there on the Hill. Whoa, gotta disrupt you again. What you just described sounds like a rigged system. That's the essence of the rigged system. Got it, got it, great. Um, sorry. The lobbyists in Washington, they own this town. If you got the money, you can get your message delivered and you're gonna make sure it's delivered effectively. It makes me both nauseous and excited. What about the steak dinners, the infamous steak dinners? Got rid of those. Do you have to order the fish? Can you not get a side? What does that mean? A group of us got a rule passed in the House that says they can't take gifts from lobbyists. That means that you can't take somebody out for a steak dinner. But if you go to a reception and you can serve the food with a toothpick, then it's permissible under the rule. You're lobbying me right now. I couldn't believe what I was hearing, and yet I'd seen it with my own two ears. It was time to nail down one of these lowlifes and make them accountable. Someone who looked like, I don't know, this guy. Oh my god, it's that guy. Pay dirt! What global conglomerate do you represent, and how do you ram that agenda down the American people's throats? I lobby on disability issues before Congress. I helped pass the Americans with Disabilities Act, which has changed the face of America for people with disabilities. To pass something like that, to get something like that through, I can only imagine the kind of stuff that you have to... So do you have a favorite back alley that you've uh, handed over a big, large sum of money? Gosh, I wish I did. We have to go on things like the truth and appeal to people's Bro. better instincts. You're killing this investigation. Sorry to hear that. Lobbyists, good or bad? Necessary. Come on. Lobbyists play a really important role in making sure that good information gets to the Hill. Gotta disrupt. So even though lobbyists do spend money to influence legislation, some are working for worthy causes? And some don't even have much money? It's not, not the story that I want, man. It always bothers me when uh, journalists come with a point of view that really isn't very well informed. I wanted corruption, greed, the greasy palming of corporate dollars. Where was my story? So how's your day so far? Kind of sucks. <laughs> lobbying is super confusing. Lobbying is just talking to your representatives. You want to find a cause that you're passionate about. Go to your politician and then just talk to them. Get their support. You want to make sure also that you get both the Senate and the House side. Very important. How do you know anything about lobbying? Well, I'm a lobbyist. This kid can't be a lobbyist. He's like a child in a suit. Can't be a lobbyist. You're, you're, you're a child in a suit. Why are you so interested in learning about lobbying anyway? I was going to expose the system. Whoa, who just disrupted me? Sorry, that was me. Look, kid, I do the disrupting around here. I figured it was the only way to get through to you. Well played, kid. I'm listening. There's always going to be the people that are representing the corporations, and there's us. We represent what we want. That's essentially what lobbying is. I don't even think I have a story. You do have a story. Tell them the best way to make a difference would be to strike at the laws. Because I'm talking to my representatives, I'm making a difference. I'm impacting the laws. Fine, fine, I get it. If you want to disrupt the system, you got to actually disrupt the system and join the thousands of people lobbying for causes, bad and good, like this kid. OK, what if I told you you can make a ton of money lobbying for a big oil company? Uh, I would turn that offer down. What do I need a ton of money for? I'm just a child in a suit.